Gyo nyo mwane genti ekele kwa angi. Nga ante, lolo, mwata wanya. Ni hino tiele mbu. Mabawa, loki iwe. Maka megide, ane megide ha. Na, hawa emutara one, Nigeria, mwa. Teka sengo moda, mwobi imeni, mwobi ilo alo, na kwa tutu hindi ozo, na kwa ebwa ni ilo, biko genti ofuma, kenri alolu mwata wanya. Ni hino tili mbu, no kiwe, no ke mwite, no biade gija mma, osi mwunia, habilie, kahaga ogwa, ofu uboro, mawe mmeri, biko, geya, no no mwata wanya. O tiri mbu no ke olu, Ma megide, atumatu ndie ke obodo ha. Ni megide, ndie nye hawo ke. Ndi nina unwa ha. Ndi hamo ta goro unwa. Mwabundi loro halo, mwabundi ekwebe galo halo. Na kwa ndi na ato ujo. Ni hi, inyan nemenu. Na kwa, ego ana anapo, ndie nye hawo ke na ndidi ha. Biko, aga masim ki igeya na ono watawani ya. Kwa uroni ya mwakubute, utuosi wa edere ya. Ndewo, ndiyo ya mwana ege monte. Hi guys, I think this is the right time to go out as Kenyans. Let us be fair, it's not about, see I wasn't born in Nigeria, but marriage makes me a Nigerian citizen. And let me tell you something, so many of my friends are heavily pregnant right now with Nigerian children. Yes, so many of my friends are single mothers. Because why? Police brutality. It, discrimination against Nigerians. The Nigerians are, are afraid. They want a relationship with you, but they are afraid to marry you. Because what kind of country is going to be mistreating them and they will come and marry us? Our kids are Nigerians. They are fatherless. We have children that are, they don't have their father. Not because their father does not want to be in their life. Because Kenya has deported the father. Kenya has used bribe to, to pursue the father. Now, we just match customers are going away. Ashau business is no longer booming. We are not seeing money because our customers are afraid to come out. If they come out, they are being arrested. If they come out, they are being asked for money. If they come out, they are being beaten. If they come out, Apana, we march. Ashawo, you come out for your customer. Baby mama, you come out for your baby daddy. Even if they have not yet arrested your husband, they will arrest you. We are scared to death Nigerians. Why? One minute you are dating him, the next minute he has gone to buy food, they have arrested him, they want 500,000. They want 100,000. Why do you want to see 100,000? You are afraid of having a Nigerian boyfriend because you don't know when they will arrest him and they will need 200,000. This issue has gotten out of hands. Ashawo, come out. Baby mama, come out. Girlfriend, come out. Wife, come out. You are carrying a Nigerian be uh, belay, come out. If Nigerians will follow us to Ipoa, it's okay. But they should stay inside. They should stay in their house. This is our country. Excuse me. We are lacking. We, 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 we are, women are being rendered husbandless. Women are being where well, we have seen small pennies. That is what you want to pursue. You want to chase them away so that what? So that we can suffer? So that we will not have orgasms? So that we... How so many Kenyan girls are going to Nigeria, Lagos, and their life is being transformed? They are being given money. My friend went to Nigeria. She did not have matako. Now she came back with matako. And you want to say that Nigerians are mistreating Kenyans in their country. They are not mistreating Kenyans. When they see you in their country, they will feed you. They will give you money. Deny it, even if you know be a shower. Deny it. Any person that has been held hand by a Nigerian man, that person is living well. Our life was transformed the moment this man started having interest at us. Now they don't want to marry us. They are afraid. Which kind of country is 